Hi, this is Steppy with Wrestling in 60 Seconds, bringing you some my views on the what's going on with Vince McMahon and the WWE. From what I understand, and from the documents that I've read, and I'm sure you guys have read them too, but it's hard to comprehend because, um, as I understand it, Vince is using the fact that he has so much shareholders in the WWE stock as leverage into going back in and running WWE. And his excuse for that is so that he can get top dollar for the media negotiations coming up with WWE. Now, with that being said, uh, WWE has said, you know, we'd love to have you back, but, you know, you have that legal thing, and do you, don't you think that that would kind of interfere with the investigations, and, you know, Vince has gone back and said, well, you know, he wants to come back, but um, he will not approve any kind of deal with any media unless he's part of the negotiations. Now, to me, that seems like he's holding it hostage, and uh, what's going to happen is he's planning on selling WWE after he rene renegotiates. And that's to drive the price up on the media so that he can get a higher price for the sale of WWE. But then what's going to happen to WWE? Technically, they don't have to keep the same people in the positions that they have. Um, but these are... My point of views, I would love to hear your point of view in the comments below. To me, it sounds like he's trying to hold the WWE hostage to get what he wants. Um, I want to thank you for watching, subscribing, and as always, bye for now.